Hello guys, I want us to look at how you can disable design view. That is, once you work on your project in Microsoft Access, uh, that is a powerful project like this one, you need to uh, disable design view. Uh, for instance, if I launch this system, uh, you'll notice that um, somebody can change. You see now, somebody can change go to design view you see somebody can be in a position to tamper with these objects and for that case it is important for you to hide right click and also design view in that when uh, you launch your system uh, somebody may not be in a position to uh, change uh, this one you see now this one somebody can be in a position to edit the stuff therefore what you need to do is to go to uh, access options therefore you just go to file here then you just go to where access options are here you hit on that then this dialog box appears that is the access options therefore you just go to current database then once you go to current database uh, these are the options that you need to uh, work with therefore you just scroll up to uh, ribbon and toolbar options then you tick you remove the ticks, you remove allow full menus, you also remove allow default shortcut menus, also you remove uh, display navigation pane. Then after doing that, you just hit on OK. Once you do that, um, uh, that is you are uh, finished with that one, you'll get this message, you must cross and reopen the current database for specified option to take effect. Therefore, you just click on OK. Then you cross your database and then reopen it again. Therefore, let's do that. That means that you see now there is no design view. I'm trying to write click. You can hear the clicks. It cannot work. And therefore, if I just key in the password here, that way, you see now, guys, I'm unable to do the right click. You see now? Therefore, the guy, uh, these guys might not be in a position to uh, see the design view. But there is a better method of ensuring that your Microsoft Access uh, document that is especially for sale is more secure. Therefore, what you need to do, you can just um, open Microsoft Access. Uh, let me just do it. Therefore, you open Microsoft Access. Then, once I open it, I need to save this one as, uh, uh, that is, as executable file. Therefore, just go to file then uh, save database as like that therefore save the database as then um, i need to first of all let's just go to this point here there is uh, this one i open it let me just open it again therefore you, you need to uh, change this database to uh, something we call accde from MDB and therefore you just go to this point here you just go to save and publish then uh, in this dialog box you see our Microsoft Access by default is uh, that is ACCDB that means it is editable therefore you change it to this you make it uh, executable that is ACCDE therefore you just hit that one and then click save us Therefore, once you do that, you save a file as ACCDE. Therefore, I'm saving it on desktop. Then I click on save. And then I give it some time. Therefore, um, you notice that uh, once you do that, if I go back to that one, if I go back to uh, this uh, database, once you turn it to ACCDE, you are not in a position to edit it again. And therefore, guys uh thank you very much for watching remember to subscribe if you haven't done that one for me and also you can comment so that i can be in a position to know where to work on thank you very much